An LDS mother says her temple recommend was refused. So was her husband's because she chose to breastfeed uncovered in the church foyer. News for Utah Sarah Martin spoke with the mother about what she calls an abusive leadership. Her daughter is about a year and a half old. She says she's never covered her while breastfeeding at church. She didn't know it was an issue until about a month ago. She's asked us to keep her name and information private for this story. Hold the breast out from the top, nurse, and continue on. She said her family sits in the foyer during sacrament meeting, and while there is a mother's lounge, she doesn't feel it's an option for her. I can't really get the spiritual blessings from the meeting. She was called into her stake president's office and he asked her to cover while feeding. So I basically told him I wasn't planning on changing the way I do it because that's what's comfortable for me and my daughter. She says he pointed to church literature and said, and It's not about breastfeeding, it's about modesty. After she again said no, she says the stake president refused to sign her temple recommend. He basically told me that he wasn't going to finish the temple recommend process because I refused to adhere to his counseling. She says he then spoke with her husband and gave him an ultimatum. Then he told him that either you support your wife and you don't get your temple recommend or you support your religion and you get your temple recommend. She says that she left the experience with even more resolve to breastfeed the way she and her child are most comfortable. They just aren't put on our bodies for men. There is no reason for me to hide. This is a normal and natural thing and it should be viewed that way. In our reporting, we reached out multiple times to the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints for this story. They've declined to comment. This mother told me that she's meeting with the General Relief Society president of the church next week. Reporting in the newsroom, I'm Sarah Martin, News 4 Utah.